Have you ever felt? Are you listening? Damn. Hello and welcome to Apple Stuff. I'm Jo and this is the PS4 Remote Play app for iPhone and iPad. Most of us, including myself, were expecting an official solution from Sony and now it's finally here, but not from Sony. The unofficial app comes from the Hong Kong based developer Bitwise Solutions. It is called Playcast and you can find it in the Apple App Store for $99. I'll leave the download link below in the description of this video. You can also get it manually from the App Store just by using Playcast as the search text. One quick download and the app is on your iDevice. Before using it, just keep in mind a few things. For lag-free experience, make sure you're using your home network. That means your iDevice and your PS4 must be connected to the same router. Also, it's recommended that you use the Ethernet cable connection of your PlayStation instead of the Wi-Fi connection. Now you can move on to register your PS4. You will need your PlayStation Network Online ID and the 8-digit registration code from the PlayStation. To obtain it, go to the Settings menu, select Remote Play Connection Settings and add a new device. There you will be presented the 8-digit code. Fill in the online ID and the previous code in the Playcast app, press register and you're almost ready to use the remote play feature on your device. Before starting remote play, it would be a good idea to visit the settings menu. Here you can increase the display resolution to 720p and 60 frames per second. You can also customize the on-screen controller or the MFI controller in case you have one. Other controllers, such as the DualShock 4, are not compatible. Playcast developers promise us a smooth and crisp gameplay with very low input latency and in our point of view the app lives up to the hype. We have tested it with both slow and fast paced games and the results were so remarkable that even Sony couldn't make it better. You can see for yourself that there is no lag between the iPhone screen and the TV screen behind. If you enjoyed our video, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe buttons because it helps us a lot. See you in the next video. Bye!